Hello everybody, Megazord review number two here, and I'm going to do the Thunder Megazord. Alright, let's start off with the Lion Thunder Zord. And uh, on the Japanese toy, since this was from Gosei Sentai Die Ranger, the head right here was green. But since, you know, Zack and Adam had this Zord, they changed it to black, and they probably got, and they got it from the black and gold Direno toy, which made things a lot easier. And so, uh, let's go on to the Firebird Thunder Zord. The... The Unicorn Thunder Zord, when actually in, in Dire Ranger, this was a Pegasus. I don't know why they made it into a unicorn, but still. Now here is the actual unicorn. In the show, they called it a griffin. It looks nothing like a griffin. Choo-choo. Uh -huh. Like Road Ranger Collector 22 said. Uh, they look like trains with horsey heads on them. And last, but certainly not the least, and the best out of all of them, um, um, the Dragon Zord. And with us, we got Rear Ranger from Dire Ranger. Oops. Okay, a few disclaimers about this Zord. I got this at the same time I got my Shogun Megazord and my Ninja Megazord. I got them for Christmas of 2007. And they belong to, to uh, well, the toys, they just smelled like smoke because the person who had these was smoking. I did not get these off eBay. I got these from one of my mom's worker's friend's sons. Uh... But still. Okay, let's get started with transforming the dragon. Take off the tail. Oops, close this. Take off the head. Put it aside for now. Put that feet like that. Okay. Let's put this up a little bit. Get a higher view. Put the legs like this. Actually, like this, put the legs out. Then we put the legs down. Oh yeah, and this arm is not open because it was glued because it was broken. Yeah, this thing is missing pieces like those yellow things right here and here we've got dragons the red dragon thunder zord in like warrior mode and here's Ryu ranger okay now let's get out to this we got this thing which can also go on top of tor and then we we take these put them like this Should put that back. I don't know. There we go. And now we've got this, and he can fit right in there. That kind of reminds you of Ultra Zord, doesn't it? Just goes right in there and he would ride in there. But still. Oh yeah, and just make the 
make this really quick before I transform it. Here's a size comparison to the original Megazord. And uh, the Battle Fleet Megazord. And the Battle Fleet Megazord is as big as the Thunder Megazord. So this is how tall the Red Dragon is compared to the E Thunder Megazord. Okay. Let's take everything apart off of this. Put that aside. Okay, now take these, open this thing up right here. Not on the Dirano toy, this was gray. Put that in right there. Put that up and we got a foot. And just do the same thing for him. And the legs are done. And now we take uh, the Dragon Zord. We put his arms out like this. And then put his legs like this. And then they both just go into here. Okay, he's starting to get bigger. There, put, put it up closer to the camera. I put more stuff up there. Okay. Now then. We'll take this off. No, I do not have the rod, so this just. I'll just stay out there. And then this just clips onto his butt. There we go. Now we go over here. We then put it in like this. And then we do this. Okay, now I'll put his arms down like this. Take this. Sorry, this visor just likes to come off. Take this off. Okay, now open this, and this would slide up his hand. Which looks pretty cool. And then you do the same thing this. Gotta make sure that you guys have a good view. Okay. So now we take this and then we do the same thing for him right here. And there. Now then. Head goes down like this and there are two clips in here. Oops. Didn't go up high enough. Yeah, this is a little broken. But hey. It still fits on great. Make sure that the head is on pretty good. And there we go. Now let's put this helmet back together. Thunder Megazord helmet just doesn't let, like to stay together. So now we now oh yeah, I forgot to put the sword. Or to right, right under here. It has this right here. That clips onto the side. One thing that's odd about this is that swords, when they're, they're supposed to be like this instead of this. Which is really odd. So now that's on the side. Okay, now let's see if, if the helmet will want to stay on. There we go. Uh, stupid helmet. There we go. And now it's on. And then we take this out. And we put it in this hand, which is a big circle, so it'll just, you know, hang there. Uh, stupid helmet. Well, rearrange up. Rearrange up. His big Zord. Okay, so yeah, this the little figures would fit inside of here. Of here, uh, yeah, little figures would fit inside of here, or you know, like in Die Ranger or Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, C 